Um, we had to head into Dubuque today to run a couple of errands before Matt gets off for his day of work. And we've got Miss Ireland and Mr. Aspen back there. But I wanted to show you a follow-up. I showed you kind of some of the rain and weather that we were having yesterday. When we get into Dubuque, I'm going to show you exactly how bad the rain got. All right, guys, so we're going to be coming up on Heritage Pond, and I'm going to show you just how full it got. We drive by this a lot. There's all water now. And it's loud in the car. I'm going to roll down the window so you guys can see this, which is crazy. Look at that. It's all water. And the docks are gone. Those are docks right here. water came up last night and there was some flash flooding in the city of Dubuque and I'll show you the street we'll drive by it of uh, where, where they had flash flooding look at that you can see water right up to the road look at this look how deep that is that's normally way down I mean that's up to the walkway He's such a stinker. Yeah, yesterday, literally, guys, that before that rain hit, I mean, those water areas, wow, the golf course. I'll have to show you. I'll have to show you on the way back. The golf course is underwater. It's a, well, it's not really a golf course, it's a driving range. But yeah, it's all underwater. All of this yesterday, within just a matter of a few hours, just went underwater. So I'm going to show you some of the area that flooded yesterday and I actually have um, a friend on Facebook that took some video and I'm going to try to contact her yet today and see if I can use some of her footage so that you can actually see the way it was last night. So right there I think is one of the streets that flooded but I know coming up here because I can see it on the video that she posted last night. This way it's flooded. Yeah, this whole street coming up here right after this Carnic drug. Oh yeah, you can see it. Look at that. You can see all the sand on the but yeah, this whole area back there was nothing but water. And there were police cars turned sideways and I'm gonna see if I can't use some of her footage today in the vlog. other than like some of the sand in the driveway, like the mud down there, but it was really bad. Yeah, you can see it flooded all the way down Central Avenue. All right, so I got a message back from Candy and she said we could use her video. Um, we were trying to get it to load to my phone, but because she recorded, it was a Facebook Live video, doesn't look like that's gonna work. So what I'm gonna do is later on when I get home, I'm gonna play it on the computer and record it, and then you guys will be able to see it. But yeah, it's some pretty good footage of last night's. It was basically a flash flood, right? Yeah, just in, in a city, but yeah. Yeah, um, and that area, it's like right around Kaufman Street in Dubuque, Iowa. That area floods, um, flash floods quite frequently. Well, they're supposed to be building something to eliminate that, but apparently it didn't help. <laughs> yeah, and so we're, not... we're wondering because they put up, what, Dubuque hasn't had actual, like, other than flash flooding, because, I mean, that stuff happens, but they haven't had actual flooding since... The 60s. Maybe the 60s, because they put up a flood wall, and we grew up in Dubuque, and we never had, like, any actual major flooding issues and now they've put this thing in downtown Dubuque and we're just we're a little skeptical because it's a waterway through Dubuque as to they say it's not supposed to flood so we'll see I mean we don't we don't know maybe hopefully it's engineered correctly but you know it's one of those things that if something's working why mess with it I don't know to say it'll anyway. work. The video is going to be really cool and you guys will get to see it here in a minute because I'm going to go ahead and post it on there for you to see and um, 
I'll put the link. I don't know if you'll be able to see the original video that you can go on and watch it, but I'll try to put the link down below in the description. And um, thank you, Candy Hogue Harris, for the video and the okay to use your footage because it's really cool. Um, and just a shout out to Candy. Thanks so much again for letting us use your video footage. just not supposed to be and you can see in that footage exactly why that happens um, and why everything's so full and if we get any more rain like this soon we won't even be able to drive down the road that we're on currently where's that water at oh here we go okay this is right by the houses this is not a pond this is not supposed to be here this is normally dry ground right by these houses and that's just how much water. Back in these trees. Yeah, and back in the trees that would normally be dry. That's, look at that. Look how much water they got. Is that crazy? Daddy's off to work. He's leaving us. Bye, guys. Bye, Bye baby. Bye. Daddy, bye. Bye. You can tell it's still really hot out because the kids are just chilling. Aspen's just chilling out in his daddy's recliner watching a movie in front of the fans. I cannot wait for a break in this heat. What are you doing? You gonna get him? Chuck's guy might get you. Did you get him? No, no, don't swap the garbage. Did you get him? So we <laughs> we found a way to overcome his fear of bugs. What happened? What would you drag out all over the floor, sir? You got a towel, a video game case. What are you doing? Look at that! You find a bug? No, I can't do it on you. Aww. Oh, we need to go somewhere. It's 
Sing it, Aspen. Let it go. I can't hold it back anymore. Sing it. Let it go. that the dinosaur is eating him. Alright guys, so like I said, it's really hot. Heat index today was about 108 degrees. Hi Zane. Wait. And we're watching Meet the Fockers. Bobby. We're having a movie night and watching Meet the Fockers. It was so hot, we even made subs for dinner. Nobody was cooking anything in this house. Hi Rhea. Look, she's like, yeah, we got popsicles. We're sitting on the couch. I took my blue one and they did all. It's green. Anyway, uh, night guys. We'll see you tomorrow. Blue tongue.